Hello, everyone. My name is Dio Morales, your host of the Gold Squadron Podcast, and I'm coming to you live from South America. We're here in Argentina having a great time, and my co-host for round one is... Pedro Segarra from Peru. ¿Qué tal? Hola a todos. Acá. Un poco para ayudar a Dion con el español. With Spanish. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> so, uh, super excited for today. Let's go ahead and start by breaking down the list. Okay, now we have... Um, well, I would like to start left, but right is a Peruvian guy, so yeah, I got uh, to start go, with go Hugo. Go for it. You do, do the right, I'll do the left. Okay. Uh, there is Hugo Cisneros from Peru, and he's Constable Subio with L3 crew, proxy mines, cloaking device, and afterburners. It's inter interesting because you cannot decloak and drop a device in the same round. Right. Let's see how he plays it. It's Guri. It's like a little fat guri. It's no, 100 little. Uh, that's 104 that's points. <laughs> More than half the list. It's outmaneuver, advanced sensors, afterburners, shield upgrade, and um, the title Virago. And then it's also a little bit fat Captain Seaboard with Predator and a steel device. Up to 200 points. That is the thickest Zuvio I have ever seen. Very yes. big. <laughs> if I have ever seen a Constable Subio because you don't see him very much. No, you don't. You know, <laughs> you know. I was looking through the list and I looked at Hugo's list and I went, huh, let's take a look here. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> All right, and on the left we have Rodrigo Amoretti uh, flying basically, this is the, the winning list from last yes. week's Gen Con, right? Uh, it's good. You got the... Uh, the Jedi here, you got Anakin Skywalker with R2 Astromech, that is a regen droid with Delta 7B. Rick Olay with Predator and R2 Astromech for regen. And Obi Wan Kenobi with regen as well and calibrated laser targeting. Now, one thing that uh, is a little bit different from our view than, than usual is you notice that we don't have the cards on the side just because of the limitations of the table. And because of that, what we actually have is we have a separate view for you guys when we need to uh, take a look at the cards. We have everything we need to see there. And the other option that we have, oops, sorry guys. <laughs> and the other option that we have there is uh, we can also just bring up the card view on the screen. So a little bit different than usual, but it's A-OK. -okay. We'll figure it out. We're here to have a great time. It's uh, South American style. That's right. <laughs> So, you know, I have to take a second and say um, I've had a wonderful time while being here. Uh, everybody here has been extremely nice, and uh, it was nice hanging out with everybody yesterday and just walking around the city and just yes. exploring things. A little bit cold. Yeah. A, li a little I'm bit rainy also. Yes. Absolutely. So for those of you who do not know, it's winter down here. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> right? So th for those of you in the, in the U.S., like, oh, it's summer. It's... <laughs> I am like on the complete other side of the of the of the, of the hemisphere in the south, uh, which means opposite seasons. All right, so here we go. Here's Sevor on the right side, just going going over the rock. Yes, he's flying in formation. I don't know how long he's going to do that because you may want to fly Guri separate from his mates. Yeah, maybe the idea is to see if he can get Rodrigo to commit one of his ships and yes. then pounce. Also, Subio going straight. So it's important to remember, uh, especially for anybody who played first edition, the fact that uh, Zuvio uh, can, has a couple of options here. He can drop the proximity mines during the system phase, yes. but then also his ability is a little bit tricksy, right? Yes, he can drop his, well, his proxy mines. Um, he can launch, actually. No, in first edition, it was he can drop right. forward, and then now he's, he can launch. And it's after he moves, right? Certain speed, yes. I believe, if I'm not mistaken? No, no. I think it's if you are about to drop a device, you can launch it using the same template. Ah. I think that's his ability. Okay. Well, well, I, well I hope people cannot blame us because we don't know Constable Zuvio's ability. Does? <laughs> Dude, there's going to be one person out there who goes, I yes. play Zuvio all the time and this is the ability. <laughs> okay, right. he, he attempted a, a lock, I think, with with Guri. Yeah. And yeah, you're, you're right. So if you would drop a device, you may launch it using a one forward template yes. instead. No pattern analyzer, so he cannot uh, do any shen shenanigans with with the uh, quadrijet action. Mm -hmm. Absolutely. So 
all the quad jumpers, I know we haven't seen them in a while, right? Because in yes. the very in before the latest points change, they were nerfed, and before that, they were really good. Yes. So they were all over the place, but it's kind of disappeared for about a season. I, I'm going to admit here in Gold Squadron podcast. All right, go uh, for it. That they are actually good. Guillermo from my squad in Peru, he told me, you have to play Yakugan Runners, they are like really good. And I was like, no, I want to play Seabor. But after the points, two points adjustments, and I was like, which build su should I play now? And I was looking, okay, I, I want to see before any points adjustment. Yep. And I was, oh, there are two Yakugan Runners. And oh, that's really good. And why didn't I think that <laughs> six months ago? <laughs> <laughs> Absolutely. There on the bottom right-hand side of your score, uh, excuse me, on uh, your screen, you have your the Choose Your Champion poll, one for Rodrigo, two for Hugo. Who do you want to win this match? So I know you, you are biased. You want, yes. you want Hugo to win. Yes, right? I want Hugo to win. But let's say Hugo was, was a random person, just, just uh, you know, some caballero from nowhere. Well, w which I, from these I, lists, I, I what would, do you think? I would choose Hugo mostly because he's a scam, a scam list. I I mostly play a scam in Peru, so okay. I want scam to win. I was really heartbroken when the scam player in Gankon, the Torquil and Kurax and Sea yeah. were lost. I was uh, like, no! Oh, that's the first attack. Yeah, first attack, Anakin into the Viper. Yes, and he's right. gonna spend that target lock that he took. Oh, two hits. Two hits. Uh, let's see. Oh, no mods and oh, Got it. just yes. just roll good dice, yes. right? <laughs> Guri's happy about that. Yes, because uh, she spent her her ability to lock, and she, she had no mods. And it's oh, it's Sivor. Sivor. Uh, they're going to to take Guri away, so they can measure right. And I think he no looks to be no 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 just out yes just out. Okay, right. and now they're entered their turn. Their turn. Yeah. So one of the things you know, Guri here is a ship that loves to be an arc dodger. Yes. Right. But she's not actually. Oh, no, uh, that was uh, cloaking device dice. Mm -hmm. But I don't think she can... Uh, well, there are, there are ships that are going this way, so Guri is not going to no. get out outside any arcs. Right, exactly. Um, and I think Ricoli made, oh, I don't know, three bank or... That's he, lo he loves three banks, oh my. <laughs> oh, or maybe five straight and then a hard turn here, so he can surround all, mm -hmm. all your squat. Get on the flank. So yes. what what I would like to see Hugo do, since Guri isn't moving last, is trying to use Guri as a blocker. Maybe for Anakin, because yeah. uh, if Sivor and Silvio is go are going to go forward, mm -hmm. it limits Guri's options. Yep, absolutely. Because the the advantage of that barrel roll is the fact that you can go a bunch of different places. Oh, but and he can have advanced sensors. Yes, he does have the advanced sensors. So he has he has some options here. Um, can still. he barrel? Sensors here and then Sechner, I don't think she fits here or um may the Segnors Hmm It's gonna be tricky but yeah. but m maybe that's what he wants. He if he advanced sensors barrel right and then Sechnor so Anakin goes forward and now oh I'm behind you. <laughs> that would that would be pretty awesome. Yes. <laughs> right off the bat. Uh, that'd be pretty crazy. All right, guys, so we're going to keep the poll open up until uh, they start moving their dials, which it looks to be pretty soon here. Oh. Rodrigo seems set. Uh, Rodrigo, but Hugo is not, not any of Yeah, well, he, he's, in, he's in a weird spot. You know, he's basically already surrounded, right? Yes. Because of how fast these ships can move. A uh, couple people in the chat asking, what are we doing about subs today? So, yes, I, I'm trying to keep track for the entire world tour, how many we can get. So I increased it by about 100, like 102 um, for this one. So we're trying to, we're, we're building up. Now, before we go too far, I do want to let you guys know that this game and all the rounds this weekend are brought to you by Curled Paw Creatives. Use coupon code BAOPEN19 
for 15% off. Of course, that oh, stands cool. for Buenos Aires Open. Yeah, Andrew was like, you know what? Let's support South America. Let's make sure Great. Uh, that we support. And again, 15% off for all orders um, using that coupon code up through Monday. Rather, you know, <laughs> I you know sometimes when I'm waiting for my opponent to set a dial, <laughs> I start to doubt what I put down, right? You're like, yes. wait. Did I? Was I right? Yes, yes, yes. You got <laughs> confused. It's going to happen a lot when we go, we go to round two and three and four and, oh, yeah. and players are more I are tired and it's like, which maneuver did I choose? Yeah. <laughs> Absolutely. Okay, so it's funny because he knows how what to do with Guri. Right. So I'm really tempted to say he's going to barrel advanced sensors and attempt and this loop. Ooh, yes, babe, that, that would be awesome. Yes, because he, he has already said Guri, and, and now uh, Subio, I like to go for initiative low t up to, to higher. Right, yeah, he had a plan already with Guri. Yes. Well, he's, well, he's revisiting Guri, no, so no, no, he might, yeah. be <laughs> might be changing here. Yeah, I'm excited to uh, be, so for rounds today, we have five rounds of Swiss today, and we have a top eight cut tomorrow. Make sure you guys join us. And uh, super excited, man. And don't yes. don't forget that after every single round, we got giveaways. We got some items that were given to us by um, the Chewy's Flea Squadron and also some official Buenos Aires Open swag as well. And, of course, I brought some stuff for you guys, <laughs> for you, you guys, some cards and things. Here we go. Oh, let's hope. Hugo. All right. Yes, Seabor. Where, um, where is he going? It Tree Bank. Okay. I mean, Obi-Wan Kenobi is coming in, so yes. might as well start pointing your, your arcs that way. Uh, but depending on, on Obi's maneuver, I don't think if Seaver is going to trigger. Well, Obi can. Uh, yeah, he can, find he can go wherever he goes. Yes, and it's also Subio. And, oh, Subio's not going to attack. He's, he's cloaked. I don't think if that's the kind of engage you want. Maybe maybe the idea here is he's just trying to keep Zuvio alive long enough so that he can use those bombs. And then Because Guri that's more reliable uh, damage. No, no advanced sensors. No, no, he's rebuilding his dial and he can... Sensor is after rebuilding dial. Truth, truth, yes. And if he's not choosing... Yes, I told you. Oh, oh there's one. But this is going off the front. Yes. Oh, man. Is he going to do it? Is he going to do it? Let's hope... Come on, Google, and another maneuver. Oh, yes, <laughs> yes, love. <laughs> <laughs> that is an awesome move. Oh, and she man. fits. <laughs> that is awesome. I need, I need some, some emotes in the chat for that move. That is, yes. that is awesome. Even, <laughs> even Rodrigo's like, yeah, that was good. good. <laughs> <laughs> when I play against people in Peru, I la I'm like trying to. To predict their movements, but but I tell my opponents, so it's yeah. oh now you're going to sensors, and sometimes they'll look at me as how do you know, <laughs> and no sometimes I just get lucky. Yeah, and this time I got lucky before, but the fact that he put the he put the Guri's dial first. Yeah, it's like oh no he he knows where Guri is going. Um, now the that recall with that three bank. Mm -hmm. Three bank gets a focus from full throttle and focus, focus action. And I think he's uh, see where he's out of his of Rick Oli's arc. Mm -hmm. And oh no, he's he's has to fine tune with Obi. Yeah, he he's sitting right there, mind you. He <laughs> he's the, he's in a bomb range right there. That yes. is launch <laughs> pancake right in your face. Okay, but maybe he. I don't know. He's no, so he's measuring, just he's asked, He asked about the he asked about the yes. ability. You could throw out the front and like, yep. <laughs> well, he has the show. Um, attempt to kill Subio right now, but it's four dice, four defense dice. You know. And I, oh, that's a. Um, the proxy mine is still going to, to block Hobby's movement. It, it's gonna. It's turn. gonna. Yeah. Huh. Um. Focus. And he's going to attempt maybe to kill Subio first. Now, Sivor will be able to jam him, assuming he still has him in arc. Yes. 
or if he's still alive because here comes Anakin. <laughs> oh yes, that's right. <laughs> also, I forgot about Anakin. <laughs> uh, shout out to Lou the Lunatic, who is at the top level of Twitch subscriber. He's got he unlocked the, the Skippy. And fine tune or not, so he can get range one and maybe bullseye against Seaboard. He grabbed the, the first charge. You know, I have to mention Pedro. Pedro's a very strong name, very good name. Yes. Because it's my father's name. Oh, I didn't think know and that. Both of my grandpas are Pedro. Well, my father is also Pedro. There you go. And I have an uncle that's Pedro and a brother that's Pedro. <laughs> that's a lot of Pedro. <laughs> that's a lot of Pedro. <laughs> <laughs> it yeah. is the most the 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 most common name in my life. Oh, he only locks Sibor and uh Jesse is going to jam. But that means Obi and Ricoli are not going to get jammed. Yep. So he's protecting Seavor, but uh, it's going to lower that offensive potential. It's uh, three attacks on Seavor. I don't know how it's going to go. To go, go however. Four dice. Oh, two hits. No no target lock, only two. Yes, he jammed. And ooh. All right, he's got to choose whether to spend the focus now. No, but, but he forgot to still device. Seavor has a still device. Yeah, he does. Yes. Rodrigo. Uh, Hugo, stealth device. Stealth device. Just add. No, no, just no. add one. Hugo, just add one more dice. Go. Cool. He had blank focus and and natural evade. Yeah. Maybe he can evade this and no. Okay. We tried. <laughs> we tried. Uh, he, well, sorry, Hugo. Yeah, sorry. <laughs> Goody first because of Flores of play order. Mm -hmm. Range two against Anakin and Goody is. Oh! Yeah. No luck there. Wishing you had a focus there. Yes. Oh, now he's. Deciding whether I would go against Seaborn. and Seaver cannot jam me. Yep. Um, Seaborn has no tokens. Only he might be afraid of the 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 tractor the next turn. Yes. Because what one bank tractor right onto this rock next turn seems bad. <laughs> yes. <laughs> but in that case, he should sh he should have lock Anakin, uh, Subio with Anakin. Right. Yes, Seaborn. no tokens, and it's both four dice. It's range two, it's only four dice. Yep. Ah, uh, oh, to Subio. All right, here we go. It's, oh. It's gonna use the force to regen the focus. Okay. Got it. Oh, this thing. <laughs> I'm not sure if I should would have shot Subio, because it's the same amount of dice. It's four dice Subio and four dice Seaborn. Right. And Zubio is the one that has the uh, the focus right now. Yes. It's two focus from Rick Oli. And yeah. it's four dice for Ugo, and it's all oh, two baits. Yep. And they went the same speed, so there was no bonus there for uh, Rick. Yes. Range three or range f range two? I think they are Seaborg against one of each. Oh, oh no, it's range three. Okay. Safe. Ooh, got it. Yes. <laughs> Only needed one. He got. <laughs> and now the dice for the cloaking device. All right. So no crit. So it only uh, triggers on a hit where yes. it goes away? No, or, or an eye? Or an eyeball? An eyeball, I think. Let's see. It's a card that we haven't seen in a while, so it's always good to just double on check. An yes, on, an, well, on a focus result. It, it makes sense because it's like, I cloak see it you. and I see you, yeah. and that, the eyeball. <laughs> Very thematic, I like it, like it. So... Um, 
Rubio is going. I'm, I'm not sure if he's going to to the proxy mines. The proxy mines are going to went here. And I think right now the better value though is tractoring one of these two ships. Right, let me look at the dial on the quad jumper again. I haven't seen it in a while. It's. Uh, I think it has all all one spin on your. Yes. So he can bank. <laughs> And Ob well, Obi is this? What if if he did one turn and, and then recall it tractor and beam forward? Forward. Mm, but if he performs a three bank, oh no! It's going to depend a lot on Rick Ollie's maneuver or even Obi's maneuver. But what about if he drops behind the proxy mines? For Anakin. Anakin. There's a he might he, he might, might hit Seabor. He might clip Seabor, yeah. Oh. Right. Well Guri is in, in great spot. Yeah, she's if ready to pursue, she's yes. on the flank. But she only maybe one for one and then a barrel, so she can has a lot of of options. Yep. And Anakin's not getting away. One of the disadvantages though, like because Anakin does move after her, is that somebody is always moving out of range one. Oh yes, right. So he's he's going to be firing unmodified shots if he's using that barrel roll. Oh, and also Seabor moves first. So, well, Seabor can maybe a three K turn or a bang, but then he's out of of the next engagement because. Mm -hmm. If he turns, if he hard turns here, he's going to block Subio. Yep. That's a little bit, bit problem when different initiatives in the game. He seems to be more confident about, about this turn. Yes. He put his dial way faster than last turn. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, they are still got any damage? In anything? Both, both clean. No, yes. Nothing yet. And as we uh, are hanging out here, I want to remind you guys, uh, I guess not remind you, tell you that we're streaming from the Buenos Aires Open. This is a community organized event. Um, if you guys don't know, South America really doesn't get uh, FFG organized play support. And uh, they really wanted a system open this season and FFG didn't give them one. Yes. So the solution was, you know what, we're going to rally the troops gathers prize support from around the community and we're going to throw our own system open and uh, as soon as i heard about it i was like you know what let's let's see what we can do if i can fit it in the schedule i want to head down and uh, it fit perfectly in the schedule adding to the world tour uh, we're here in s streaming from south america it's an it's an amazing thing how um, the game has connected so many different parts of the world with so many yes. people um, i would have never Come to South America. D. Yoon here from the Fly Better podcast is the head judge. Hash slash I Marshall. Am the law. <laughs> 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 We're just having a great time here, and um, so just shout out to our, our brethren here uh, down in South America. Amazing people, great X-wing players who we don't always get to see because uh, there's not as much support down here. Yes, well, we have to tell you that when. It was like the rumor that Ghost Squadron Podcast is coming here, and, and many players were looking at your your weekly streaming and yeah. When it, it is to confirm, we we don't know if he's coming. Yeah, let's hope. <laughs> and when you finally say I'm going to Buenos Aires, like oh yes, that's right, we're this here. It's going to be great. Right there, you see the <laughs> got the official Buenos Aires Open mat. Um, Super excited. You know, shout out to uh, everybody who organized this. And I have to give a personal shout out to Alejandro, who has yes. taken great care of me, making sure to have somebody to pick me up from the airport and to hook me up with a hotel room. I mean, it's been amazing. He's a great TO. Yes, absolutely. I mean, he's a he's a TV producer, right? He, that's, yes. He's, he's good at organizing things. Yes. <laughs> you can tell. Okay, now... Um, this is going to be a really tricky turn. Yeah, I mean, Hugo is deciding whether or not to drop that bomb. I think you're right. Yes. And oh. Rodrigo knows that there's some pain yes. coming. <laughs> okay, the, 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 the chat was right. If he launched the bomb, 
of the mine is going to complicate Sivor. Yeah. So he cannot do that. Unless he turns Sivor away, which yes, could, would be odd, but it could happen. Yes, but he only has two ships firing, so if he takes Sivor out of of the equation, it's it's like, oh, oh I only have a green. Oh, it's... Okay, so he's going to do a three forward. Uh, hitting the rock doesn't matter for these TIE fighters yes. because of their uh, their ship ability. And this round, he's not going to have problems engaging because he's not going to have any shipping arc. And now it's the bank. Oh, he's going he's for Obi. He's going for Obi-Wan. I mean, that one's more of a guarantee of clipping that rock if he decides yes. to do the tractor. Let's see. Let's see it. Come on. Do it, Hugo. Ramos. Do it. You know you want it. <laughs> he's, he's doing, yes, there the it tractor. There is, the tractor. He's Aye. in the bullseye, so it is technically a double tractor, yes. though a, a small base ship only needs a single tractor token to be moved, medium base two, and large base three. Oh. That's, hit, that's hitting that rock, no matter what maneuver it is. Yes, it's just depending on whether or not he's going to stay on there. I hope Rodrigo has real, um, maybe a, a too hard turn is out of the rock. If he, if he real oh, it's a bomb of Guri. No, no. Maybe no, maybe we'll see if he puts down a token. I think it did bump. <coughs> um, no, I I think it she didn't because. Yes, he's okay. He's, he so he's taking a lock there on Obi Wan. Oh, not no, not, not inside. Oh, okay, on, on Anakin. And now let's see what Obi Wan did. Do oh, what? bank three, three bank. All right, that g guarantees that outside? he's out of the. Uh, I'm surprised oh. it's to the outside. He's not going yes. after Guri. Now, it is important to remember that after you go over the rock, you can still use fine-tuned controls. Yes, but he has to roll the die. Oh! Takes a shield. That's the first blood there. Yes. One shield off Obi-Wan Kenobi. Yeah, and he's telling you what you just told. He can do the fine-tune. Fine yep. I think he realized Ugo was going to track to Obi, so he did a trip bank. Try to avoid him getting shot. Yes, because he was going to defend with one less die. Yep, and now he can he can barrel roll out to make sure that he's out of range. Yes. Uh, he, he, did, he didn't he do did, it. No, he didn't. And it's, oh, it's going to be a bump on... A hard, a hard tree for... For Sivor? No, for... No, sorry, for, for Rick. For Rick, so ah, he's going. Okay. Mm, I'm not sure. No, no, he's he's going to bump the quad jumper. I, I have to tell in Peru, mm -hmm. um, in General Skenubi squad, which is uh, Ugo squad, yep. they play a lot of uh, quad jumpers, but not the Jaco Good Runner, but the name the name one. The name one. Yes, Alberto. Which is from the same squad. He play a lot, um, many many matches with Unkar Plot. And it then there is Anakin. You know, I actually like the uh, the comment here in the chat. Somebody says, "I wonder if the next the next level of play would have been to not tractor him, because oh. the three bank <laughs> would have left him on top of the rock." Yes. <laughs> It you anticipate it and it doesn't happen. <laughs> yes. <laughs> that's right. a fine tune for Anakin. Yep, that's probably range one. We'll find out when they start measuring for attacks. And it's a barrel roll for his action. Out of Guri's arc. Mm-hmm. And that'll definitely bring him into range one there. Go as far forward yes. as possible. And Seaworth's ability, when he can jam, but they don't have any tokens. Yeah. Mm, not in the locks. It's going to be four on four. Four on four. Because Seaworth still currently has his development. 
his, excuse me, his stealth device. Yes. Here we go. Let's four Yanaki dice. Knights. Ooh, it's good. Spending one for us. So for three hits. Got oh, it, got it. Yes. Spend the focus. You have to spend the focus. Or you know, though he does have another shot coming in. But it's unmodified, so yes. yeah, there you go. Um, or maybe per Predator? No. no, uh, no. You're right, Predator maybe. is going to be on. You're right, you're right. First Guri and Guri, no. Maybe Re no, Ricoli I think is out of range. No Wobi out. and no Ricoli. No. Nope. No attack for Guri. Yeah, I like that opening move from Hugo, but it has put him uh, really far outside the fight. Yes. Just out of range. And it's range two. Range two, Rick, against. Oh, both, both of, uh, both three speed maneuvers. Only to die. Yep. Mm. There we go. So the Predator, oh, yes. That seems to be on. But only for one. I think she was. Oh. Not today. No damage. Yes. Well, Ugo's problem is going. Is that he's not attacking with many ships. Right. So he's. You're, you're right. He's behind the damage curve. Still checking for the stealth device. Yes. Um, he's doing a good job of keeping Rodrigo not doing damage, yes. which is great, but, but, but he's, the not doing he, he's not any doing damage, any damage either. And they all have regen ships. Essentially, with when anybody brings regen, you're essentially adding shields yes. to that ship. Like They're, they're going to get the regen off. It's going to happen, so you got to get through them. Maybe Obi here. Um, I would say a nest loop, but maybe the 5K, so he can get out of Guri if, he, if, if she goes forward. And he can regain the shield. Mm. He lost because of the of the rock. Yeah, yeah. There's no reason to, for him to get hyper aggressive. He's yes. not behind at the moment. But the problem is, um, if he does that, then Ricoli. Oh, sorry. Ricoli can do this at the boost, and now it's all against Guri. I'm not sure. If he drops the proxy mine, he's going to hit Anakin. No, he's far. Uh, he's going to be far away, but he'll get Rick the next turn. Yes, for sure. Yeah. So I think we're going to drop. We're going to drop the death pancake, the but death pizza. <laughs> yes. But <laughs> but Ugo is not doing enough damage. So even if the proxy mines hit Ricoli, he can regen. Right. He he would need the turn when he hits the proxy mines against any of Rodrigo's ships, and then kill it yep. in the same turn in the engaged phase, in the engagement phase. I mean, maybe something a simple one bank with Guri, you focus and you try to, if you can get the shields off of off of Rick this turn, you might be able to take out yes. Rick. It's um, unforeseeable at 3K, 3K turn, and no tokens. And let's hope the rock is blocking Anakin's going forward. Yep. So or maybe Anakin just uh, an S loop. So he can, and now he can be the one chasing Guri. Mm -hmm. I like that. I actually like that move a lot. And now it's Ugo who knows where that's right. is going. That's right. Rodrigo's Rodrigo. a little nervous. He's <laughs> well, right, so Scum always brings some type of tricks, something yes. to make you think a little bit harder, and that's, that's what's happening right now. That's a fun of Scum. Yeah. <laughs> Last, last time in Peru there was a player and I was like, why do you bring... I, I, for, I forgot which ships are great, but I remember his answer when I asked him, why are you bringing this? Uh -huh. Because of all scam dirty tricks! <laughs> <laughs> love it. Love it, love it. Now we got 220 beautiful people watching across the world. Oh. How's it going, everybody? Now, I know it's a little bit early across the United States, which is the majority of our audience. But listen, you need to wake people up and say, guys, the Buenos Aires Open is on right now. You need to be watching. Yes, it's only round one, but let's go. Yes. Come on. There are a lot of players. There are a lot of great players here. Yes. Epionic, no, you're beautiful. <laughs> <laughs> so uh, Buenos Aires is in Eastern Time plus one. 
It's like an hour later. So right here, uh, we are 1049 right now in Buenos Aires. Oh, they are, they're not sure about their dials. Lou the Lunatic in the chat saying, uh, I'll be watching this morning, but tonight is my baby shower. Well, congratulations yes, on the baby. Didn't, didn't know your, your family was with child. Congratulations. That's awesome. I look forward to streaming many games for you while you hold your child. Oh, All right. he, he did dr drop. He dropped it. Here we go. Now that's going to, to be hard for Oli, for Rick. Oh, yeah. And now this Seaborn. It's going to be a tree heart. Yes, a tree heart for for Sibor. Okay, just trying to trying to bring it around. He wants to focus. I think that's yes. the reason why we didn't yes. see the K turn there. Because if he can keep Anakin chasing him and he's not taking damage, uh, that's that's a good strategy. Yes. Because in Hugo's list, Sivor is the cheapest thing. Yes. <laughs> He's only 40 points. Yes, yeah, that's the focus. And now uh, the quad jumper, it's three bank. Wookie Barber, where are you watching from? Saying watching from Asia. What part oh. of Asia? I've been wondering if, like, I know there's a couple of guys in Japan who play X-Wing. Where are you at? Alrighty, Zuvio moving moving away from the destruction zone. Yeah, but it's still the same problem. He oh, that's after burners for Zuvio, but only Guri is going to have an attack, and he should lock with Guri. He should yeah. Uh, um, well, he has a lock on Anakin right now, right? Oh uh, no, he does have a lock on yes, Anakin. Yes, I forgot about that. The Philippines. It's t 10 p.m. Yes, it's Asia. It's all around the world. The world. And it's okay. And all right, four forward. He's he's going after Obi. That's yes. who he wants. And maybe a lock or just a boost. Now the now the problem is if if Rodrigo fury out, he's going to three hard. Even even over the proximity, and then focus on Guri. Yes, right. that's the boost. Got a boost. So currently in range one, we'll see what uh, Obi Wan does. He hasn't moved yet. And uh, no, that's the boost for afterburners, I think. And then he has luck. Ah, uh, okay. Obi Wan. The hard three. Tell me, it's a hard three. No. Did he avoid it? Yes, he avoided it. But now it's hard to chase Guri. Good move there by by Rodrigo with Rick avoiding the bomb though that also means that Anakin is um, is not going to be able to go whoopsie go in that window wait they don't have much time left no only 36 minutes left so if Ugo can keep the fight between Guri and Obi over here and no Rick and no Anakin, maybe he's going to win because Obi is in three who left. Yeah. If he if if Obi regains, he's not going to attack. About let's see. So, so no weapons disabled token. No. And I think one hard. I, okay. To kill, he wants to take Subio. I I would have regained the shield. Ah, okay. I will, I will, I will share that. That's a fine tune. So Guri probably still has a shot, but it's going to be range three. Yes. 
and he should now focus, so he has a focus on attack, a focus for defense because of Obi's ability. ability. Yep. He might be tempted to bear a roll, but he's going to throw it on a focus. He's got three agility and yes. infinite focus. Not really infinite. He can just re re is, regen is, the focus is, is, twice. Is Obi at Xibo's range? Uh, in the bullseye? No, that's all. Oh, in Seavors. Uh, maybe. Because I guess he could jam off that focus. Yes. Oh, but Seavor is definitely in Anakin Bullseye. Oh, for sure. So there's a target lock action. Yes, he's not going to lose lo the lock. It's three against four. And let's see. Let's go, Anakin. Oh. One of each. Uh, yes. The luck for. Ooh. I'm surprised he didn't keep the focus. Yes, I would have spent the four there. It worked or out, though. Way. <laughs> <laughs> Three hits. Coming in. Seavor. Seavor. Showing that he <laughs> refuses to die. No and damage there. Okay, now Guri. Range two. You're going to hold three. it down. It is close. Range three, I think. Oh, I'll maneuver. Also, it's Martin Liu. How's it going? Oh, hit, crit, that's crit. great. He, he can actually kill Obi. No, not today. Not today. And it's I'm okay. And sp spends the force to keep the focus. Man, that was I'm close. Sure Hugo got excited yes. there. He saw his body <laughs> tense up. Like, oh. <laughs> Range one against Subio. So Calibrate is going to go ahead and add a focus result after oh, the attack. Oh, is this good? Oh, yeah. He's going to spend the focus. Remember, Zuvio can't shoot him back because he's currently cloaked. And yes. Zuvio has four dice coming in because of that cloak. Uh, but he has a focus. And it's... Oh, oh man. Green dice are on fire. They this, are. This <laughs> match. <laughs> And now Seaver, it's yes. And Rodrigo did not choose to keep the force, uh, the focus, with his ability. It wouldn't have made sense. Seaver would have just yeah, take it away. Um, He's deciding whether or not to spend the focus. He should. Right. There's nothing else coming in. Yes. No. On, on defense. No, no. In defense, he rolled Natty sweet. With Seavor. Oh, Seavor. No. No, you're fine. No, Seavor had the focus. Oh, yeah, I forgot about. But Seavor yeah. rolled Two. Natty's yeah. almost, so this they didn't spend the focus. Oh, okay. It no, didn't matter. It didn't matter. Obi made it all. This rock has done more damage than any ships. <laughs> it's the MVP. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to ask later who brought this rock. Yeah. <laughs> the super rock. Yes. <laughs> Apostasis in the chat says, the southern hemisphere have inverted Dion's dice. The <laughs> greens are hot. <laughs> they are asking if we in South America have blanks yeah. in the green dice. <laughs> DU says they, they're rolling in the other direction. And he's still rolling die for the clock device, and it is still there. Yep. The no, clock, clock device has a couple nobody charges. Nobody wants to go away, not even the clock device. <laughs> Man, sore. Let's see what. Okay, so Guri now, she has kept the lock on Obi Wan, and she has the out maneuver against Obi Wan. Mm -hmm. And if Obi Wan refuses to regain, eventually it's going to She's hurt gonna him. It's gonna get him, yeah. It's gonna get him. I, I'm, if I'm Obi Wan, I think I, I have to find a turn right now. To maybe to because of Orik, Oli is going to spend a lot of time going back to the engage. Maybe going for Seaver and what uh, some someone point in the chat. Maybe the cloak here and then the turn so Guri can come here and then a kill box for Anakin. 
unless Anakin goes five forward and then boost and it's yeah. all over. Yeah, if Rodrigo sees it. I do yes. like the decloak option this turn, though. That but Rodrigo good. has been reading Hugo's planning, Hugo's yeah, strategy very, very well. Very well. That rock is Dwayne Johnson. <laughs> 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 oh, that's Vince from, from Peru. Hola, Vincenzo, ¿qué tal? Gracias por seguirnos acá en Buenos Aires. Now, people in the chat just want to let you know I can see both YouTube and Twitch. So, YouTube, uh, it's th the, the combining of chats is working today, which is nice. So, hello out there. Thir 30 minutes left yeah. in the round. No damage yeah. has been dealt. By ships. Yeah, by, sh <laughs> cor by correct. ships. Hmm. Oh, they are even discussing final salvo. They have realized they have not yeah. done any damage. Yeah, so if it comes down to final salvo, it's printed dice, right? So you got two, 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 two six two dice versus two, three, two. Only one more die for Hugo. Yeah. It's going to be close. But, you know, this is... Again, I want to go back to the fact that Hugo has the tricks in his list is what has forced Rodrigo to be cagey. He he can't yes. just he can't just go in there like I got regen and I'll be fine with the with the tractors and the bombs outmaneuver um, and the jamming from from Seavor. That's a lot of tools there to uh, keep those Jedi at bay. Yes. No. Neither Obi nor Co nor Subio had had plays or dials. I think the safe course is five forward with Obi and then fine tune. Yeah, I, th I think you're right. It's going to be definitely away from from Guri. Um, I don't think that yeah, even this, the proximity. This is the one where we're. Oh, okay. That's yeah. that's the one in question right now. Now, decloaking and the bomb happen in the same phase, right? You yes, can do them in either order. But you can't do them both yes, at the same you, you turn. Yes, you can't do them both. Got it, got it. Okay, now... Wait, I think Rick's options are only a hard three to the left or a talon three to the left so he can return quickly. Okay, let's see Seavor. Oh, no so, proximize. So no, nothing in the system phase. No yes. decloak or bomb drop there. I, I don't think that's the right course because it, Obi's going to move away from there. Oh, or maybe he's trying to get away from Anakin. There's a focus for Seavor. And that's uh, a sloop. But unless he eventually decloak, uh, you don't want to have Subio chasing any anyone. Right, exactly, because he <laughs> he's cloaked. Now, Guri. The only threat he has out there is that bomb. Yes. The hard two. He's got to focus here. Need to have double modified shots into some type of target. Yes, but she can only calculate. Oh, here. <laughs> yes. The robot. <laughs> yes, she's a robot. At least in the game. Okay, that's the calculate. Yep. So if Obi actually perf um, placed a 5 forward, then he's out of, of any trouble this turn. That's a left turn roll. All right, Rick being aggressive here. Yes. And if I'm not mistaken, that was faster than Seavor. No, Seavor performed a three bank. It was a three bank? Okay. So it was a great job from Hugo for ha having so his, <laughs> his ships. Because Rick, Rick hasn't been able to use his ability yes. at all this turn. Yes. Oh! Range one, he has to use fine tune to get yes, out of there. Yes, he has. He's, he's, in, he's in two arcs. Uh, remember, Zubio can't shoot. Yes, that's a fine tune. But Guru is going to hit him without maneuver, so it's going to be two die. Target lock and calculate. Calculate. 
maybe a barrel to at least is obstructed. That's what he's looking at. That's yes. Yeah. Well, most of the time, oh, it's hard to say because you have a force. Like a focus is always better than an extra dice. Yes, but but you have the force. But you have the force, so it's. I'm sure somebody at, at home can do the math on that. Extra die versus a single modifier on the on the focus. Should be pretty close. He's grabbing a token. He's doing the focus. And it's going to be a tree. That, oh, oh it's a bump. May have bumped himself. Between Padawan and Master. <laughs> yes. All right. That's going to be be a collision, which means... I mean, Anakin does have the force available. Yes, two force. So no and action he there. Still, that lock is for... Which which ship did he lock the sewer? This this lock is from who? Not sure. We'll find we'll find out here in a minute. Ooh, hit crit coming in. Uh, is no, it, no, and it's not Anakin's it's lock. No, it's not Anakin. It's hit and crit and it's. Ooh, Ooh. crit gets through. Fine. Stealth device broken. Yes. Let's listen in for the crit. And the crit is. Disable. Oh, Disabled that's bad. Disabled power regulator. So when you engage, take an ion token, which is going to be this turn. Yes. So he'll be ionized next turn. And now he needs to range two, and it's unobstructed. I think it's unobstructed. Later. Oh. That's two crits and an eyeball. Spending the calculate against Obi. The, the crit's going through. The heat and crit is going through. Oh, it's hit and crit. Obi can be dead this turn. Let's find out. Nervioso. Nervioso, <laughs> yes. That's the word. And you know, this is Rodrigo being punished for not regen. Yes. It's putting putting him in this situation. I oh, know there, there was two crits. It's two crits? Yes, it was like like one hit and two crits. He baited a hit. It's two crits and it's... Blinded pilot, pilot damage Ooh. engine. He's lucky to be alive. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. So he's down to one hole there. Oh, he just... He, he needs to fly to Tatooine. <laughs> <laughs> to hide there. He's not... He's giving, giving away the demo V. He needs to regen actually too. And it's unobstructed against Seaver. Ah, oh, no. Luck was for Rick. So now he's jammed. He lost the luck. Alrighty. To die. One only, hit. Only one. Oh, and he that's, oh he's, he's got, got a focus. focus. He got the focus. <laughs> Four evade seems like yes. enough. And no other attacks this round. Zeke the Beast, yes, you do have the the follow and the subscribe button are separate. Uh, yeah, you gotta click the the follow button to get those, and the bell to get the notifications. If you want to stay, you know, up to date here, that's the check for the stealth device. Up to date on all of our streaming endeavors, have that bell ringing, and you have plenty of Gold Squadron podcast streaming content coming to you multiple days a week. Um, now Ugo's winning, but if Obi can regen the shields, so yeah, he's he got to regen both. So right now he can get uh, some five, five forward and, and boost, fine tune, uh, and out. and then go away and then regen all shields. So it's back to and he hasn't used either of those uh, of those charges. All right, we can take a look there. They have spent both afterburners in Guri, I think. Yep, both afterburners are gone. The Virago boosts are still there, though. Oh, yes. Yep. Yes, they are. It's uh, one Proximite and uh, one Afterburner for Subio. And, well, the cloaking device is still there. Yeah. Well, he definitely needs to regain. It's 
Oh, but Obi Wan only has one shield. He can't regen. Oh two. yes, you're there right. There is no more half. Yes, he cannot get back. I forgot. I I thought he yeah. had the the Delta Seven B configuration. Right. Yeah, so we're we're very used to seeing that. Yes, the the calibrated yes. laser targeting is only really showing yeah. up with Obi Wan. There is no way Rodrigo can take back that. 29 points. So now Hugo has to hold on, right? But he can actually kill Seabor. He, he knows where Seabor is going to be. Yep, one forward. That's all that's happening. Which means that Rick can get his ability off for the first time yes. in this game. Uh, even a, an only two, two forward. And, or maybe uh, he has to... Uh, Anakin is in, in the way of I, Rick's. I got, I got a crazy idea for you. What? what? I got a crazy idea for you. What if Zuvio comes in you tractor, oh. you tractor him and try to get him far, <laughs> farther away. Run, run, <laughs> or maybe you barrel roll, barrel roll three bank, maybe. That mm, could be crazy. That would be crazy, yes. <laughs> or maybe even tra a tractor him this way because I think Anakin is going to bank, and there's no way Anakin is going to hit him. Okay. And Rick, Rick is doing a two forward. Yeah. His or hit, hit boost and, and get a shot, but only if he figures it out. I hope. Oh wait, but he has he has he can, he he can't. Sorry, he, he has he's ionized, so he has to go one forward. But he could still be tractor. No, but he can be tractor barrel uh, yeah. down here. Yep. And if Anakin banks, there's no way Anakin is going to hit him this turn. Right. But I I don't think you're not used to tractor your own ships. Yeah. You can, <laughs> but you can. You don't. So you can you can tractor him. He goes one forward, and you focus and hope, right? Yes. Now, he actually needs to kill Sivor to be winning. Sivor at fat, at his, at his, is only half 20 points. Mm -hmm. mm, are they ready? Because it's all or dial set. Ah, no, Rick's not ready. The, the one forward in rig is blue or white? Uh, in the Naboo. Let's take a look. Oh, no, he has to. It's white. It's white. Yeah. He might as well only two forward. If he bumps, he's the same as doing one forward, being stressed. Oh. Okay. Actually, good point in the chat. Thank you for the Gambler Tuba for that. Rick can actually not even use his ability against ah, Seavor because, because there's, there's no, no dial. No dial, no yeah. reveal maneuver. Yes, no, no reveal maneuver. You have nothing to, to compare Seavor's speed. Exactly. Rick would probably for a straight... Yes, if there is no shenanigans with the, with Subio. That's right. Now who's missing Anakin? Anakin's dial. Oh, they know. They, they got maybe about two turns left. Yes. Only two. Now, I do want to remind you guys that after this round, we're going to be doing some giveaways, starting giving away that swag. Our giveaways are brought to you by our patrons. Talk to you about that in a little bit. Oh, it's party time. D Cloak? No, no, no. No, it's, it's Ion. Fun. Okay, I was he, hoping he, he, I was he, hoping he, he, he was a boot. He had put the, the dials for Seabor, but it's no, right. no use. He, you don't assign dials for Ion ships. No, 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 no. He cannot barrel. No barrel roll. Yes, only focus. To see if they catch it. Yes, he did. Yeah, okay. Yes. Or, Rodrigo told him. That's the focus. And now, he, I hope I w Hugo... Forgetting that he couldn't barrel roll might mess up what Zuvio's doing now. Two forward or three? Three forward, yes. Yes. That's going to start start hurting. He's going to push him forward. Um, so no action there. Mm. 
but still you, he, uh, Rodrigo has to, to kill Sibor. He Cibor. still gotta kill him, yeah. Half, half Subio is less than half Obi. Okay, now Guri. <laughs> I'm gonna just, can I show it off? Yes. Nice. <laughs> okay, he's debating now the advanced sensor for Guri. Come on, Hugo. Okay, he's revealing Guri's dial. And it's all oh, for forward. You know, I'm holding the champion trophy in my hand. Oh, that's a cool trophy. Yeah, we'll show it off later. Yes. <laughs> you know, Guri's for forward, but... Um... Guri's in a bad spot right now. Okay, Guri may be blocking Anakin, but uh, Ugo has. I, I want to count when when you upload this to to YouTube. I yeah. want to count how many times Ugo actually attack. I yeah. think it's I should like two. Yes. Right now. Or may maybe even even three, but it's Guri is now a, a blocker over there. He's blocking Anakin. Got to look at all the angles. He has quite a few options with that bendy barrel roll using the one bank. Yes, but um, if he was thinking of blocking Anakin with Guri, then he should have left it there. Does this barrel roll fit? No, I don't know. Um, it's going to be around close. the ship. What, you can't? Like trying to chase Obi Wan? Um, I, if it fits, it's going to be close. Well, actually, he has a lock, and um, Guri has a lock on Obi, so it's, it's either calculate or barrel, or if, if he wants to block Anakin, then he should leave her there. Calculate and pray. You'll get a focus if you have somebody in range one. I think he's going to block Anakin, and then I think if even if Anakin goes with a three bank, he's going to be a range one for Guri, so she has uh, to focus. They're taking too much time debating. That's a calculate. He grabbed the calculate token. No, he he, he changed. He, he he's grabbed gonna, the. He's gonna go for the barrel roll. Yes. Uh, yes, he needs to actually shoot at re Rodrigo's ships. Mm -hmm. Okay, now now I think maybe first Obi Wan. Okay. Which maneuver did he reveal? Three hard? No, two hard. He's flipping the regen shield on Obi Wan. Yes. No MOV recurring, but at least one. Well, it's it's what you have to do. Yeah, exactly. You just you want to make sure he doesn't die, because then yes. you just give up more points. Oh, dying. he's planning to go back to the fight. Rodrigo wants to play. Yes, Rodrigo because wants to play. <laughs> <laughs> I wouldn't have done that. I would have, okay, barrel boost away. Leave but Rick, you know what, leave Rick and Annie. <laughs> it's work, it's the working work. out, though. Uh, yes. Guri. And now recall is to forward, maybe. Or four straight. I think it's four straight. Yes. That one person in the chat guessed it right. It's four straight. Uh, we have to. We do have to remind them about the if. D. Um, no action because it's a wide maneuver. Just in case. Just real quick. The so Seavor was ioned. I'm assuming that Rick's gonna shoot Seavor here. But he had no dial, so no Rick bonus. Correct. Just in case, just okay, in case thanks. it happens, it, it's coming up here soon. And that's the bump, 
Anakin did bump, but against his own mate. He's got range one still. Yes. He's got the force. He's fine. This is fine. Yes, but Guri has to focus and Gu did. Did he catch did him in arc? Did Guri close. have a shot? So Rodrigo going into Seavor. I think that's yes. the right call here. You want to try to take him out. Yes, as a focus for because of Guri's ability, and then yes, everything against. It's four die against three die, three force token avail available. And he oh he only if he kills Seavor, then Subio can drop can launch the last mine. Um, that's not very good dice. Some force. Two force for two hits. It ca it can't be enough. If we go blanks out and Ooh. Ooh, that's close. Gets close. Gets get through Rick. one hole down. You still have Rick's. That's half points. Score twenty to twenty nine now. Yes. Rick's got a shot. No, first uh, Guri and oh. Is he gonna clip it? Yeah. He does have. He could take out Obi Wan from long range. Oh, he's at range, but no, he's in arc, but it's. Uh, in our, oh yes, range three. Oh, that's a good call because of the sloop. Our oh, maneuver doesn't trigger. Oh, oh, there it is. Hit crit crit coming in again. And he needs. Oh, he's rolling four di four die. Does it mean he's going? Yeah. Okay. Ooh, he's got it. He's yes, got it. He got he's it. got it. One force. Um, and Obi is disarmed. Rick only only against Seaver. Oh no, I don't think the D there's right the, there. There's the right there. <laughs> um, the f the fun fact is that if he, if Seaver is out this round, then Suyo can launch the, the last yeah. proxy mines. <laughs> That's very true. No, and then Zan Seaver's going to be alive, and there is no proxy mines. <sighs> that next feels turn. bad for Rodrigo. Yes. <laughs> he did get half. And Seaver. Yeah, and Seaver, only seven minutes left. Mm. Now Guris is stressed. Um. Our Canadian brethren out there saying that uh, that some a bunch of internet was out in Canada last night. Oh, so th they they were annoyed. They couldn't live their 2019 lives without. <laughs> 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 well, I mean, I'm glad that they're tuning in. That means that they're uh, they're watching from, uh, you know, now. Yes, um, they're asking how many rounds today. It's five. five rounds. Five rounds. Cut to top eight tomorrow. You got to go five and zero oh or four and one to make the cut. Now back to dials. Wait. Oh, um, the, the crit was repaired. Ah. I am yep. Now, if he drops the proxy mine, uh -huh. he's only going to hit Saber, right? Rick is like yeah. a little bit far. Okay, and finally the cloaking <laughs> device. The cloaking device is broken. Yes. He's going to attempt barrel roll. Oh no. Um, okay, in the rules reference, it says that if he so fails the. There's something interesting there. So, yeah, he failed. Yeah, go ahead. You were, you were about yeah, to yeah, say yeah, it. Yeah. Go for it. If he fails the, the cloaking, then he keeps the, the cloak token. Yep. So he, f it's it's a really weird interaction there. Yes. So he he attempted to decloak forward. But there's Rick. But there, Rick is in the way, so he can't do it. Cloak token stays oh he can't uh, Seaver's um, five forward is red in the um, in the mining tie fighter mm -hmm. so he cannot go five forward and no. focus maybe Pick four four Brute. four yes and uh, if he performs a four forward then more it's more likely that he's out of Rick's ability 
but not against Anakin. The problem is not Seaver and these two ships. The problem is Obi and Guri. Mm -hmm. Because Obi is going to face Guri with only uh, one yeah. hood and one shield, and Guri has four three. And blinded pilot. <laughs> I mean, yes. bli so oh, that, blinded pilot. Blinded pilot. So he can't target lock. He cannot use focus and then Obi's ability to recover the focus. Exactly. So naked pilot ability while well, he's got that. Yes. Or maybe he wants uh, to kill Seabor and then have Subio. So half Subio is like uh, 28 points and Seabor is 20 and it's no. Yes, it would be 68 and Obi is 57. So Rodrigo would be winning if he can. If he can do it, though. He's only he got one it. turn to do it, though. Yes. That, that is the, the challenge here. There are only left Guris and Subius Dials. So I would say uh, Ugo's list is a fun list, but you have to be prepared to not having that many attacks with yeah, your list. Oh my goodness. So it's hard because uh, more m most players want to I want to attack, I want to, to engage. Yep. Thank you to David Anton for subscribing to our YouTube channel. I want to remind you guys that's a, f a free way and a simple way to support us just by uh, hitting that subscribe button on YouTube. It doesn't help us monetarily, but it just shows your support and keeps you notified about all the, uh, all the things we got going. Also remind you guys can use your free Twitch Prime subscription on Twitch, which uh, does actually give us some of Amazon's free money. Amazon's like, hey, we set up this way, very, very, very kind of weird and complicated way for people to get give free money to Twitch content creators. And I made a video for teaching people how to do it, exclamation point prime in the chat uh, to see the video. It's only about three minutes. All righty. He's going to drop. Dropping the proxy mines? Huh. Um, that's only if Seabor is going right. Because if Seaver is going left, then there is no sense of dropping them. Or maybe he just realized there is only less than three minutes so left. So might as well drop yes. it. Yeah, okay, which maneuver did Seaver chose? Oh, one is one, good. One hard barrel roll, probably. Or just stays right there, actually. Yes. Oh, um, if he barrel roll left, then Rick can f go through. Yeah. I didn't think that about that. It's it's a great maneuver. Sometimes when you feel like you need to go fast, go slow. Yes, <laughs> that's right. Okay, that's the one forward for. Oh, and he can even track to Rick now. There it is. It can be a great turn for Hugo. By Rodrigo's body language, I think he didn't see that coming. Yes. Well, I, di with, I didn't either. Well, with Zuvio pointed that way, he had so many different options, right? Yes. And he had he has the weapons. So now the, the decision. He can either tractor Anakin or Rick. Both of them are in that ra arc I, at range I, one. Oh, yes. I would. Uh, I think you tractor Anakin. Yes. As far forward as possible. <laughs> there it is. He, he pointed at Anakin. Anakin. You have to choose Anakin. He's a chosen one. He's a chosen. <laughs> yeah, you have to choose him. <laughs> and that's a barrel roll. No, no rock for Anakin. But if he, if he chose a straight maneuver, he's going to, to bump Saber. Yep. That also removes uh, one of the dice, bringing Anakin down to single attack die. Yes. Ah, he cannot perform advanced sensors. Guri was stressed. I don't know the one bank. And I think you leave Guri there. Obi has not no many options. And he has Guri still versus Obi Wan, baby. I 
And Guri is a fat Guri. It's four hull and three shields. There's no way Obi... Or maybe Obi... No, Obi would have to be very lucky to, to get half Guri right now. And it's like nine seconds left for the round. This is the last round. Yeah, for sure. 100%. Okay, that is now that's time in the uh, round. only calculate for Guri. And now, which is like for Obi? Oh, he bumped. He, bu he got he bumped. All right, there you go. Guri's happy about that. Yes, but if if Rodrigo kills Seaborn this round, then it's victory for... I don't... Hmm. Okay. I think only Rick's going to get a shot maybe at Seavor. Oh, no. Maybe Obi. Uh, no, yes. Obi, not, not even with a boost. Oh. See. Uh, <laughs> Rodrigo is saying it doesn't yes. matter. <laughs> oh, uh, he wasn't going to shoot. Uh, that's, uh, he's still stressed because the 5 forward is white. And now Rick. Oh, Rick is go Rick will have a shot because he's bumping. And now uh, it's two against one speed for Seymour. He has oh, extra die. you're right. <laughs> he gets the four dice here. No oh. mods, but an extra die. Oh, man. He only needs one through. <laughs> and Seymour no, is one left. No mods on no mods. No, no. Seymour did the, the focus. Oh, he does have the focus. Okay, there and, it is. And now let's see about Anakin. But Seymour no longer has that self device. It's going to be uh, four on three. Yes, and then Anakin, which has one first leave. Oh, he was <laughs> he was going to reveal the proxy mine. <laughs> I reveal a proxy mine on the other side. Okay, and now it's a two. He's going to bump. Yes. I, I two with with oh, so it's, with it's, it's okay. all down it, to Rick. This is it, Rick. Rick Ali, hero of the Republic? Question mark. Maybe. Oh, Rick does have Predator though. Oh yes, Rick has right. Predator. Rick has Predator. It's Fox for Guri, but it doesn't yep. matter. No shots on Anakin, no shot for Guri, no shot for Obi. It's Here's the game. Yes. Yes, four against three. Here we go. Here goes Rodrigo, and he has Predator. He's, he's still his opponent, no, don't roll eye. Yeah, here it is, here he, it is. He has the Predator, and it's... Oh. An eyeball, hit crit. He needs one to get through. He needs two blanks, and it's... Oh! oh! That's the game. That is the game he, right there. One crit goes through, <laughs> and he kills Seymour right there, right oh. at the end. Holy oh. crap! Forty to twenty-nine. Yes. That's the way to end the game. In the last round, it's Rick Ali, <laughs> hero of the Republic. <laughs> Great game. Yeah. You know, this this is one of those where it wasn't extremely action packed, but it came down to the wire. Yes. Thank you so much to Rodrigo and Hugo for playing. It's time for giveaways. It's time for giveaways. Okay. So I'm gonna br bring you over here a little bit. Let me let me adjust some things. So I had I had to put this this awesome poster made by uh, Crazy Vulcan. Uh, he he made this poster. We're actually gonna make it printable here pretty soon. It says Isofane is turning the tide, but he can't do it alone. Support oh. <laughs> support Gold support Gold Squadron <laughs> podcast. <laughs> so um, today is is brought to you by you guys, the giveaways. You know, you guys, all of our Patreon supporters, our subscribers. Uh, it's all none of it's possible without you guys. So let's go ahead and uh, and do give away some some stuff here. Um, oh, we wanted to show off the trophy. Yes. Yes. The amazing trophy. So um, I was told by Alejandro uh, that he was very surprised when he saw the Gen Con uh, trophy. Yes. Because this trophy got produced in January, okay, before they announced it. The Buenos Aires Open, it is an attack die, okay, which is absolutely awesome. Yes. And the winner will be going home with this one right here. Sorry, we can't give this one away, okay? Yeah, no, that's not, that's not a giveaway. <laughs> uh, but what we do have, what we, do we have, have some tokens that people gave us. Uh, let's go ahead and start. This was from the uh, the Chewy's Fleece group. The Chewy's Fleece Squadron. It's a cloak and an evade. Yep, shaped like the Falcon. 
Now, uh, in order to participate in the giveaways, it's extremely e easy. Now, anybody is eligible for this, by the way. It doesn't matter where you live in the world. Uh, you are eligible for this. All you got to do is type in the chat here on Twitch. Sorry, we don't do giveaways on YouTube. We only do them on Twitch. So uh, make sure to switch on over. If you like watching on YouTube, that's fine. Just switch over to Twitch now. <laughs> <laughs> All right. All right, Pedro. So I'm going to hit the button, but you read the name. Okay. Okay. So the winner of the double-sided Chewy's Fleas Falcon Cloak of Eight is... Uh, Scythim. Scythim. Congratulations. Congratulations. All righty. We also have... Uh, for round one, we have same from Chewy's Fleas, the Let the Wookie Win, range one. Here we go. The winner is three, two, one. Corp Radek. That's right. Corp Radek. And he, now I got I to gotta reach for my... the range Wang Ruler. That's right. Let's find... Where's my box? My box? There it is. Okay. So, the next thing we have here, what's that? Is Kylo oh. Ren. Kylo Ren in the silence, sir. Yeah, this is the GSP Kylo Ren. If you were a uh, a patron in the first quarter when we switched over um, to second edition, this okay. was this was one of the cards for that. Kylo Ren is honestly probably one of my favorite. You got his face reflecting in the oh, windshield yes, and his car. Yeah, ah, oh, it's so cool. All right, here we go. Three. Two, one, roll and it. It's to Diconic. Congratulations. All right. And for round one, we got one more for you guys. Uh, those of you who woke up nice and early to to watch, or maybe you're just, you know, it's normal time for you guys. No, let's do it. Let's do another Kylo. Another Kylo. Another Kylo, Kylo Ren. Three, two, one. Uh, I don't know how to pronounce that. It's a high 85? It might be AJ. AJ. AJ, AJ 85. Sorry, my, I'm, I'm it's, a Spanish speaker. Oh, no, it's fine. Yeah, the J. I, 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 you said it, and I was like, that's not weird. That's exactly what that says. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So for those of you guys who are watching, uh, thank you so much. Now, people a lot of times ask, like, Dion, what are you going to do anything special for patrons today? Like, Absolutely. We actually have a uh, – which one is it? Is it this one? Nope. Oh, no, not yet. <laughs> so we have um, for new patrons, all right? If you're a new patron, we're going to be doing some giveaways for you guys uh, for this week. And that is we're going to be giving away some Ahsoka Tano, Ahsoka Tano. acrylic cards, baby. That's, that's plastic. Oh. Okay. So super, super nice. And um, yeah, we're going to be giving those away uh, as new patron giveaways. We have a, a few of them to give away. So get pretty good chances. We also have some... Uh, Anakin Skywalkers we're going to be giving away later on for uh, for Twitch and as well as I, well, I'm, no, I'm down to very few of these the Poe Dameron's the first acrylic that we made so we, we got some nice stuff for you guys make sure you're tuning in uh, we'll be back here in a, probably in about 10 minutes yes about 10 minutes and uh, we should be ready to go again Isophane is turning the tide but he can't do it alone you have to support Gold Squadron Podcast today. <laughs> All right, guys, we'll be back in a little bit.